Watching 13 News, Kansas News Leader. Sounds of the season return to downtown Topeka this week. First Presbyterian Church will again host Noon Noels. Associate Pastor Pat Yancey is here with your invitation. Welcome to you, sir. Good afternoon, Melissa. Thank you for having me. Well, we just talked about the Christmas story. We did, You're we gonna did. get us in the spirit of the season with music. For those yeah. who haven't heard of Noon Noels, what is it? Well, Noon Noels is a program that's been around since the 90s at First Presbyterian Church. And it's just designed to get everyone who comes uh, into the spirit of Christmas. The program includes uh, singing of Christmas hymns. People can just call them out from the, uh, from the audience and we'll <laughs> sing them. Uh, and then we also bring in an area high school musical group each time and they'll perform a Christmas program for us. And then we include just a little bit of scripture and a brief uplifting message for the Christmas season. And that is all sandwiched in between an opportunity for lunch. We have- uh, That's why you said sandwich. That's right, yeah, that's kidding. right. <laughs> you can come at 1130 and have a, a quick lunch, or if you wanna watch the program first, you can stay afterwards and have lunch around 1230. And uh, great food, great fellowship, and great fun, and just a suggested donation of $5. And, and even if you get there and go, gosh, I forgot my $5, come on and have lunch with us anyway. I love that oh, yeah. that open invitation to the community. Really, how important was that concept of, you know what, we can do something really quick to help Yeah, and, and that's, that's what it's all about. We have people that work in the downtown area. We have neighbors that live in the area. We have church members. They all come, they all get connected, they all share the Christmas spirit. How, who's on the agenda this year? So I this love week, how you try and get, yeah, yeah, it different begins this kids. week and we have a group called uh, Deo Gloria from Cornerstone Family Schools. Uh, next week, we have uh, This Generation from Washburn Rural coming. And then the following week, we have the Coraliers from Shawnee Heights High School. Coming. A little bit like the Advent season. Absolutely. The three Wednesdays leading up to That's Christmas right. like this. If, by the way, if anyone has not heard Dale Gloria, I can say they can go to my Facebook page, go back to the Veterans Day Parade, and they were providing some of the music for the Veterans Day Parade downtown. So they they're, they're kind of getting around. Mm -hmm. I like it. How do you choose the menu? Well, we have different, good Presbyterians always have a committee and we have different committees who <laughs> take a particular Wednesday and that, that team of people, they're involved in picking what the menu will be, preparing it, serving it, and it's just a wonderful time. Presbyterians have committees, Catholics and Wisconsinites, we have potlucks. <laughs> <laughs> That's what unites us, right? That's right. Food is something That's that right. is also common to everybody. And when you think about how your event has grown, how important has it become to bring this back every year? It's, it's been amazing, to be honest with you. You know, we, uh, we have a mission of serving the community. And that means reaching out and bringing people in and bringing them together to, to again, celebrate the Advent season, to get ready for Christmas. And it seems to grow every year. If you can't happen to, to make it to us, you can watch us online. We also will be live streaming each of the programs at noon on, uh, on Wednesday as well. How has that really improved the outreach and, and given you some good feedback when Amazing. you've been able to do the live streams? Yeah, it's more than doubled our outreach. It, it really has. We find that uh, so many people, not just in the Topeka area or even in Kansas, but people really all over the country are now finding us online and watching our programs. It brings even more people together, right? Absolutely. So it's kind of pros and cons of the pandemic. That's Live right. streaming became a necessity and now it's a wonderful, wonderful tool to yep, have and be able right. to share with everyone. Remind us again where First Presbyterian Church is located and then the time frame for these again. Okay, so the First Presbyterian Church is located uh, right there on the corner of 8th and Harrison Street on the west side across from the State House. And the programs will begin at, at noon um, on the 6th, the 13th, and the 20th. And uh, you can either grab lunch at 1130 or you can grab lunch afterwards at 1230. So Cornerstone Family School will kick things off this Wednesday with the first noon Noel and then Washburn Rule and Shawnee Heights will be after that. And when you say a brief devotion to start, I know some of our, our crews that have gone to cover this and share it with the community on our news say it really was brief. They get right to the music because the music's the star of the show. That's right. It is. <laughs> Let those kids shine. Appreciate it. Pat, appreciate Thanks, you telling Melissa. us about noon Noels coming back to First Presbyterian downtown. We are keeping a chill in the air with the snow on the ground. Find out how much we might warm up 